welcome to the premiere of Kill a Bitch. The film is about a woman who takes part in a deadly game in which she has to kill five people or all her friends and family will be murdered. Yvette Rowland, Alex Reed, Robin Reed, Ben Dover, and many, many more. It's a killer cast. I'm the killer bitch. I, I'm the lead. Um, I basically play a lady who is, gets trapped in a game, and I have to kill five people. Uh, and if I don't kill the five people, uh, five of my friends and family get killed. Oh, my God. So, uh, and I get help along the way by different very macho men and I get to shoot uh, five people. Are you looking forward to seeing the film? Yeah, I'm looking forward to seeing the film, yeah. I've heard, uh, you know, there's a lot of controversy around it and I think sometimes that can work in your favour, so hopefully it's going to be, you know, it's going to be a good one. And do you think we should see more British gangster films? Um, it depends on what they're like. There's, you know, there's, a, there's been a lot of moody ones out there. There's, well, the good thing about this film, I think, is there's a lot of real people in it, so that's what creates so much interest about it. Okay, so you're the director of the film. Yes, I am the director of the film. How are you looking forward to seeing it? Have you seen it yet? This is yeah, the first time. I've seen it. Yeah, I think it's all right. I mean, it's a low-budget thriller, but it's. Uh, I don't think people should criticise it for being low budget. It's good fun. Uh, it's got a great uh, British bands in there. You've got a lot of criminals in there. You've got a lot of good looking women. It's a kind of uh, film you want to see when you come back from the pub at 11 o'clock. So are you looking forward to seeing the film? Yeah, I've heard it's a bit of a, a, a gritty one. Um, not my kind of movie, but I'm going to check it out. I've got a lot of friends here, so I thought I'd come down so it's all, so it's all happening. You know. I thought you'd, you'd love a good gangster film. Uh, I've been going to quite a lot lately, actually. All gangster English movies, but... Um, um, I said, no, there's a lot of British people here, which is great, you know, because some of the movies I've been to, the premieres, like America, it's always mixed people, but this is all like real English, yeah. South London. When I was filming it, I didn't actually film it in sequence, so I've done a bit at the end, a little bit at the beginning, a tiny bit in the middle, and then got whizzed off for seven months. So someone had to dress up with a bald head and get shot, I suppose. So what was it like working with the director? Uh, yeah, superb. Uh, superb, yeah, I've worked with him a lot, he's, he's, he's the nuts. What part were you playing? I was Camilla. <laughs> oh, you're playing yourself? Yes, I am, yeah. And did you enjoy working with the director? It was amazing. I had great fun. fun did time. you work with Alex Reed? No, unfortunately I didn't get to, but um, maybe another time. <laughs> you never... I've, uh, I know most of the people that are in it, and there's been a lot of hype around it. I think it's going to be quite a controversial uh, movie. It's a bit near the knuckle. So, you know, but I'm an artist and a musician, and so um, yeah, I'm interested in looking into it. There's lots of fighting, isn't there? Are you a, a fighting man? Um, in my youth, I'm a bit too old for that now, but um, yeah, when I was in the Navy, I used to be a bit of a fighting man, but now I'm just an artist. I'm in a band called Alabama 3. We did the music for the Sopranos, and uh, that keeps me busy now. Fighting days are over. I have the tear up with Alex Reed. <laughs> You, you have a turn up with Alex Reed? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Did you win? Yeah, yeah, but he's, he's, a, he's an Andy fella. Like, he kicks hard, he punches hard. And he's a lovely guy. I do like him. And what do you think of his acting? It's good, yeah. Yeah, he's an all-around nice guy, yeah. 